Welcome back to Tips and Tricks uh, for Wix websites. So I just did a uh, video on how to add an image as full screen. And now if you want to add text to it, um, here is a full width image. It's on a strip. And here is a title and a button. So if I wanted the, the title and button uh, over to the edge, say I want it all the way over to the edge, then it's past the guidelines that I should have. So on a smaller screen, if I preview this, on a smaller screen, it's going to get cut off. So to avoid that, back to the editor, I'm going to move this back within the guidelines. And then I'm going to change the strip layout to left aligned. So anything on this strip is going to be left aligned. If I click off of this, It's not really showing. There is some kind of a glitch. It is left aligned. So if I preview it now, these, these guidelines should be changing so that the line is showing about here and anything within this area uh, will be showing on small screens. So to show that it's working, <laughs> um, if I make this smaller, now the text stays on the screen as the image gets smaller. It doesn't get cut off. So even though it's not, oh, now it's showing. Um, here is the guideline. So if you just see one dotted line here, that means that it's either left aligned or right aligned. So I could change this to right aligned. And of course it's not changing, but then you could put in information on this side instead. And if I preview that, then that stays on there. If you have trouble, if it's hard to read this um, text because of something that's behind it, then I'm just going to put this here just to show you. Then you can change the strip background. You have it as an image, but then in the settings, you could change the opacity of the image. Right now, the color behind the image is black. So I'm going to change that, say, to white. And then I'm going to change the opacity of the image so that you can read the text with the image behind it. The other thing you can do is change the text to white. And then in settings, change the color to black and see how that makes it pop. You could even add back some of the image and that's not too noticeable that you darkened the, the background, but now you can read the, the wording. And I guess that's good for now. I hope that helped you. And you can subscribe for future uh, videos for more information or contact me with any questions you might have on a certain item that you're having trouble with. All right. Thank you.